fish? Oops. Yeah. Wow. Where'd that one come from? I don't know. He came from underneath. Oh, it's a tiger. Lake St. Clair is a musky factory, and there's something special about being here in the long days of summer with lots of opportunities. And I've got two heavy hitters with me. I've got pro guide Mike Albert and Rick Albers from Chaos Tackle. Mike, we've been out here a lot in the summer. What's gonna happen? Well, I'm hoping a lot of big muskies hit the bag. Big wind, big water, big baits. Hopefully the muskies are biting. We're gonna have some big wind, that's for sure what they're calling for. Rick, I know you're kind of partial to certain tackle companies, but what do you think is gonna be the, the hot baits today? I'm gonna to be throwing a Medusa. All right, I think Medusas, Poseidons, maybe even some blades, any of that stuff in the big wind can be good. The Muskie Hunter, brought to you by Yeti Coolers, Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's, Ontario, Canada, Shimano, Power Pro, Mercury Outboards, Ranger Boats, Motor Guide, Muskie Frenzy Lures, and Chaos Tackle. When there's miles of water in front of you and hundreds of feet below, you need a boat with the chops to dominate, no matter the conditions. with the strength and technology to overcome the elements and the competition. Ranger Boats, still building legends, one at a time. As muskie anglers, we all plan, prepare, and are consumed in the pursuit of a trophy muskie. Skix is available with two-piece saltwater tested tough technology for easy storage in your boat or truck and are designed to handle any musky lure. You can be assured you're backed by precision Shimano technology. If you fish for skis, you need these. Coming. Just a little guy. I'm coming. <laughs> Rick, you got it? Got it. Right here to the back. Quick scoop. Yes, sir. Nice job, Mike. Thank you. We'll take them. Nice to do some fish first thing in the morning. Yeah, beautiful. Can you get right. started? Nice Pull way to start. your weight. Go on. He's going. All right. Got a beautiful morning out here in St. Clair. Nice chop. It's going to be super, super hot. I mean, they're talking, you know, 90 degrees, heat index through the roof. Just gorgeous musky fishing weather. <laughs> Mike, we started out here. What do we got? What are we fishing on this spot here? So what we got here is fairly deep water for St. Clair, 17, 18 foot. A lot of weeds. Uh, it's really clean water where we're in. The water's been super clear this year, uh, so which means the weed growth is a lot higher than normal and a lot thicker than normal. So. The fish have been holding here, a lot of bait in here, a lot of perch, a lot of shad, a lot of suckers in these tall weeds. So we're just gonna make these long drifts across this using the wind as a aid and cast over these giant weed beds and catch a giant. It's a fish. All right. That's well, actually a pretty nice one. Sure didn't fight. Ready? Huh. How about that? Yeah, she's off. Wow. Didn't 
didn't even fight. She just come and swim at you? He just, yeah, yeah right? felt like a weed load up and set the hook and didn't feel like anything. Reel in and about halfway in it starts shaking, so. Weeds with teeth. Weeds with teeth. I like weeds with teeth. Yeah. I think this is gonna like just swim away. Fish! Crazy guys. Crazy little dude. <laughs> wow. okay. All right. Tornado down there. I know. He was like wily. Little spotty one. I think he was born a couple weeks ago. <laughs> Always a good idea to start off with a variety of baits. Some fish might want it high, which your bucktail will come in play. Some fish might want it low, where my weighted medusa is going to come in play. And some fish just might be neutral, not really fired up, where something like the Poseidon is really going to come into play because it's a kind of a very, you know, invasive bait that's coming through the water. So if you're not really sure what's going on, multiple baits, different depths, and different re retrieve speeds is going to help you find more fish. Here comes one. Oh, oh, swing and miss. <laughs> he nipped at it. Just didn't get him hooked. No. <laughs> mm. Ah, fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, where'd that one come from? I don't know. He came from underneath. Oh, it's a tiger. Tigre. I think it's a big tiger. Nice. Yeah. Nice tiger too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it came up out of nowhere. I went in, started to make a turn out of figure eight, and she yet LaFella came underneath the boat. Never wow. saw it. But I like those eats though. Yeah, yeah. Spectacular. Very nice. Oh yeah, pretty. Pretty fish. Wow. Nice. See ya, dude. All right. Let me get this hook out of here. There's no feeling like it when you've prepped the gear, done the research, found the spot, nailed the presentation, and now there's only one thing left to do. Keep fishing. So gear up with all the best fishing gear, only at Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's. Shop in-store or online. Sure. <laughs> oh, look at that big dude. That's a huge fish. Yeah, I know it's a sheep's head. It looks like a sheep's head on the sonar. It's absolutely incredible. I drop down 15 feet, bang, there he is. It's actually showing the fish actively swimming. I mean, there is no doubt when you see him. See, I can see fish out almost 120 feet. I would have never caught any of those fish today without that active call it. At Mercury, we invested thousands of hours of engineering manpower so you can enjoy hours and hours of untapped horsepower. The V6 Mercury Pro XS. Light, quick, efficient. Mercury, go boldly. At Mercury, there are no limits to what we'll do to make sure you have no limits either. The V8 Mercury Pro XS. Light, quick, efficient. Mercury, go boldly. As musky anglers, we all plan, prepare, and are consumed in the pursuit of a trophy musky. Skix is available with two-piece saltwater tested tough technology for easy storage in your boat or truck and are designed to handle any musky lure. You can be assured you're backed by precision Shimano technology. If you fish for skis, you need these. The 
tour is back. Yeah. Ontario, Canada. The breathtaking scenery. The incredible wildlife. The endless sunsets. And the muskies. Ontario, Canada is home to the greatest musky waters in the world. And giant muskies are awaiting your next cast. Ontario, Canada, where musky dreams come true. Travel safely in Ontario. Emily Roussel from Sturgeon Falls, Ontario, caught and released this 41-inch tiger muskie from Lake Nipissing. Yeah. Ah. That swung and missed. Did it? Yeah. Fish. Fish. Yeah. You reel that in when you get that in? Yep, Oops. I will do that. <sighs> this one hit away from the boat. And the waves, now if they're really scrappy, we'll take them. See ya. One behind it. He ate it. Quick scoop. There it is. <laughs> nice one, too. That boy, Jimmy. <laughs> and he's off. Nice work. Truly barely hooked. <laughs> awesome. This IC 10's got it going on today. Definitely getting beat up, but that was really cool coming in that turn like that. This was a nice one, Mike. Oh, man, really? Sure really? Like oh, yeah. That's a really nice fish. He's getting, oh, <laughs> he wants to go. Look at that one. Yeah, that is awesome. He wants no part of this boat. How big you think that one is, Mike? What do you think? 46? 48? That's probably close to four footer. Yeah, I think so. I bet it is. There we go. Nice. Bye -bye. Have fun. <laughs> fun. Rick, you got a pile of medusas back there in the back of the boat. Do you have any idea how many colors you have? And how do you keep coming up with new ones? That's what I want to know. Well, we normally stock 14 colors, and at any given time, I probably have another eight or 10 colors in stock, two on the website. Uh, new colors, that's always fun because- uh, There's keep, a fish. Oh, fish, fish is on. Right. on a color. Nice. nice one. Hook. In, in the bag. bag, nice. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> Get a photo of him too for you. That is a summertime Medusa eating musky here on St. Clair. That is why you come out here, battle the waves, battle the wind, throw those big Medusas, and you catch big ones. Nice fish, Mike. Really beautiful. That's what St. Clair is for. Easy girl. Oh, there you go, baby. Awesome. And that's on a custom oh, color. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! That's fun. New colors for show seasons are actually designed a lot by uh, guides that are out there every day. They throw ideas at us and uh, we play with them and send pictures and get nods and okays. That's how most of the colors are made. There's a fish. Yep. Want him? Tie 
Tiger. Yeah. Yes. In. In. Just that simple. He's in. Anytime out here on St. Clair where you got some clear water, you can never go wrong with black, gold, and white. It's one of my favorite colors out here. Catches a lot of fish. Just landed me another nice tiger. They're such cool looking fish. Beautiful. That is a beautiful tiger. It is. I'll let her go. Yeah. And probably catch another fish. Watch, Watch out. I'm about ready to get the double digits here in a minute. <laughs> no, I'm just like, okay. <laughs> oh! <Another one. laughs> Excuse me. Try to get around. That's all right. I'll bring her back over on this side. Okay. Sneak oh, attack. Man. That was like a sneak attack for you. That was. That was a sneak attack. And there you go. And in it goes. A little guy. It's still fun to catch. Absolutely. Go be 57. <laughs> I get lots of questions about the new Shimano Skix Muskie rods, and they truly are incredible. But my most common question I receive is all about the two-piece construction. Now, not every Skix rod is two-piece. The eight and a half and nine-foot models are. And what's really unique about these rods is that they have been saltwater tested tough. So a lot of big saltwater fish have been caught on the similar two-piece construction rods, so they're super strong. You don't have to worry about a muskie breaking this rod. What's great about this two-piece design is the rod blank fits inside the reel handle or inside by the grip here, it goes right in this way. And by doing that, you don't have extra materials that add weight to the rod. You don't make the rod out of balance where it's tip heavy. You've got really, really good balance and you maintain that feel. All the vibration coming through the rod, you feel it in the reel seat. You've got tremendous balance and tremendous feel. And that's what makes these Shimano Skix rods so special. You've got incredible technology, a really well balanced musky rod, something that's super strong, it can handle any musking. At the end of the day, you can simply pull it apart, fold it over, and store it in your rod locker or in your truck. There's no feeling like it when you've prepped the gear, done the research, found the spot, nailed the presentation, and now there's only one thing left to do. Keep fishing. So gear up with all the best fishing gear, only at Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's. Shop in-store or online. Ontario, Canada, the breathtaking scenery, the incredible wildlife, the endless sunsets, and the muskies. Ontario, Canada is home to the greatest muskie waters in the world, and giant muskies are awaiting your next cast. Ontario, Canada, where muskie dreams come true. Travel safely in Ontario. When there's miles of water in front of you and hundreds of feet below, you need a boat with the chops to dominate, no matter the conditions. With the strength and technology to overcome the elements and the competition. Ranger Boats, still building legends, one at a time. At Mercury, we invested thousands of hours of engineering manpower so you can enjoy hours and hours of untapped horsepower. 
The V6 Mercury Pro XS. Light, quick, efficient. Mercury, go boldly. At Mercury, there are no limits to what we'll do to make sure you have no limits either. The V8 Mercury Pro XS. Light, quick, efficient. Mercury, go boldly. It's time for the Yeti Tough Moment. It's not often that all musky stars align. Canada had just opened to U.S. anglers after being closed for a year. The weather had been hot, humid, and windy for several days, and there was a huge storm approaching. Mike had the muskies dialed in, and it was just a matter of making systematic drifts across a giant pack of hungry St. Clair muskies. It was an absolute feeding frenzy, with Mike, Rick, and Jim boating 13 muskies before the storm arrived in early afternoon. Now that's Yeti Tough. The way the wind is blowing, all you gotta do is lob it up in the air and it'll yeah. go. They're biting. They are. <laughs> Here it comes. Oh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> just had to bring it by his face. Jeez, isn't he? The... There he is, a biter there. Oh, he just sneaked up with a sneak attack. There's the scoop. There we go. Yeah. It's that many. That many muskies. And it's not even noon. Mike saw really deep, the fish falling really, really deep behind it. So he stayed with it and all of a sudden I saw him down there and I took the bait, I took the bucktail and actually moved it right in front of the fish. I brought it right in front of him, sped it up past him and he said, I can't take it. Got to eat it, didn't you? Yeah. I got gotcha. you. Figured you'd see that because I I saw it like out here, but it was yeah I didn't see it seven you know? feet behind it. And then when I went over here, below. then I saw him down there. So then I went down in yeah. front of him, and the minute I went brought it in front, of him, he's like oh hello, right. you know yeah I'll eat that. Hung. If you're gonna bring it in front of me, you're gonna make me eat that cheese curd. <laughs> make me eat that cheese curd. <laughs> cheese curd. That sounds good. <laughs> What I like to do is kind of read the fish and what they're reacting to and what they're eating. Jim's getting some action on the bucktail, which is high in the water column. So I don't want this really far down deep. So what I'm gonna do to keep this Medusa up high is when I cast it out, I'm gonna make short rips. Just short rips and reel up my slack quick. Short rips, reel up my slack quick. I keep popping it up a little bit, short little rips. And this will keep it pretty high in the water column. It might only get about five, six feet down. Jim's bucktail is a foot to maybe two foot down, so I don't want my Medusa way down deep. I want it high in the water column. Now if it's where they want it slow, then you go to a different type of cadence where you're gonna do longer pulls, longer pulls and reel up your slack. Longer pulls, reel up your slack. This will cause that bait to fall for a longer period of time when you pick up your slack. Now I'm getting the bait down 10, 12 feet if the fish are gonna react to a, a deeper presentation. So if you want it high, more of a quick rip, rip, reel up your slack, rip, rip, reel up your slack. Deeper cadence, longer, slower pulls. There we go. I got it. You got mine? Yep. Oh, come out. Coming right in. And going under the boat. Ready? And nice. The San Eagle Medusa it's, uh, was a show color with the first year that we were making Medusas, and it's become a proverbial favorite. We try to keep them in stock all the time. It's my favorite and a lot of other people's favorite. All right. Oh yeah. Nice little spotty one. You bet. Fawn spots. Fawn spots, yep. See ya. 
There's one. Fish. <laughs> uh, that's called quick release. Nice. On the Poseidon. Eagle Poseidon. Nice little spotty one. This one's going to just go away. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Nice one. Yeah. Yes. Woo. All right. Oh, curling. Getting ready to get. <laughs> She's going <laughs> to. Just wants to go. Look at that. <laughs> She's gone. When they want to go, you got to let them go. That was just an awesome eat, too. I could just see it. I just, uh, you know, a bait was, oh, I just rolled on it. Yeah, exactly. Yee 13 fish. Now that is an incredible day. Thanks, Mike. Thank Thanks, you. Rick. That yeah, was great. That was awesome. Awesome. Lake St. Clair is an incredible fishery. And when you get out here, you got to fish with Mike Halbert. But you better bring the Medusas. Join us next week for the Big Fish Adventure on The Musky Hunter. There's a fish. Yep. That's a really nice fish. Quick scoop. There it is. <laughs> Gave it a speed burst and just boom. That's what St. Clair is for. The Musky Hunter has been brought to you by these fine sponsors. Got a floater. Glad I'm not trolling. <laughs> the days are so long, it's, it's, I'm crying. Yeah. Had. You had. I had her. <laughs> 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 She's gone. <laughs> oh, fish. Oh, fish, fish is all right. On a collar. That's some TV. Drop the mic. <laughs>